Okay, story time. So, I don't know if you know, but I moved to Los Angeles, California from Atlanta, Georgia. And it's been a rough couple of days. I got here on Saturday and guys, look how I've been sleeping since Saturday. Aww. No pillow, just a sheet and a blanket. How did this happen, you ask? So, last Monday, today is Monday, currently. My mom shipped my car from Atlanta to LA. And it takes 30 hours to drive from Atlanta to LA. But with breaks, it's probably about... I don't know, 50 hours. So why did it take them seven days? Seven times. Seven times 24, do the math. Why did it take them that long to get here? And then today, you know, I'm blowing up their phone like, hey, like, where are you? Where's my car? They're like, it's gonna come tomorrow. So I'm like, okay, like, I'm gonna cry, all this stuff, because it's another day, I don't have my car. But they just called me and they said, they're coming today. So I'm so excited. I'm about to go get my car. I'm really, really excited. If I allowed every annoying moment I've had during this move to put me down, I'd be in some dirt by now. Yeah. This move has been extremely hard for me, and I desperately wanted my items to hurry and make my empty, foreign space feel like a home. The truth is, being in California so far feels very fake. I feel like my body is physically here, but my mind is still in Georgia, with my friends, with my family, with my relationship. But the sooner I realize it's not anymore and I am here, the better things will be. I made a friend here named Pearl. <laughs> Our academic advisor for our grad school paired us up together. And this is the first time that someone who said y'all should be friends or connect actually got it right. I'm very glad I have her here with me regarding this big move or I'd be miserable. Guys, I'm so tired right now. We were not able to finish the wall. So I'm going to keep on decorating because I got to go to bed. I'm not sleeping crazy no more. And yeah, we'll add that later. Finally getting my items was the highlight of my move. I felt like the linkage from Georgia to Cali was finally paired. To be honest, not having my items scared me. I was fearful that something would happen to my car and I'd be left with nothing. No one wants to watch me unpack the kitchen stuff. Let's skip this and get to the good part. As my room comes together, I feel more physically present in my new environment. I feel more comfortable in a space that is completely new to me. You don't need to go over the top to make a home feel like a home if you feel this place though. You just have to find what works for you and what makes you feel comfortable. Me, personally, I love pink and girly sceneries. If things get ugly, at least I know my room is pink. The rest of my wallpaper finally came so I can continue to put it up. I also got a fan to go on my next team too. Congratulations. I hope you got through it with no complications. I find it amazing. I pray for strength and happiness as I settle into my home far away from home. And I hope anyone watching this video looking for ideas to make their home a home find plenty. With love, Blair Ski.